I think this entire experience for the last few days has been extremely gratifying. Wonderful ideas, wonderful conversations, gives you a perspective of what, is, what are people talking about. But what has been extremely exciting is the engagement that people have for India and what is happening in India. Uh, and I've, this is like I said, I've come back to IGF multiple times and it, it is fascinating to see the curiosity and the interest people have about India and about business in India. So extremely uh, interesting. You know, um, I'm a little disappointed that the last COP did not result in what it should have. And I'm really expecting that now the leadership uh, gets together and puts the money where, the, where their intentions are, uh, which is what has not happened. So uh, there, is, there is the biggest challenge that we face today for sustainable development is leadership. And I think India is poised very interestingly with wonderful leadership that we have that is committed to this. But then the other leaders in the world need to really put their, put their intentions to this. And I'm really hoping that that changes and we have some very good results coming out of COP28. Like I said, if, if the intention is correct and if the money is put behind those intentions, because the problem today that the, that the, uh, the, the South is supposed to solve is something that has been created not entirely by the South. So, and that cannot be done entirely by them. So that has to be the key and I'm really, really optimistic that something really good will come out of this one. Because if not now, it's going to be too late. I think it's, uh, I was talking about this with a friend this morning. This is the only uh, conference that I keep coming to where we touch upon so many different issues. Because every time we have a conference, it is either if I go for a sustainability conference, we are preaching to the choir, we're talking to the same set of people. This is fascinating because I have heard people talk about AI, talk about culture, talk about actors, um, the, the Bollywood, the influence of India, its cultural revolution. So it's amazing and it gives a very interesting perspective and nothing else puts uh, India on a stage, on a global stage like IGF does. So kudos to you.